Hey there people, how are you doing? So today we are going to take a look at Samsung's Galaxy Buds Plus. And this is Samsung's latest and greatest competitor in the ever increasing true wireless earbuds category. So firstly, let's get them out of the box. And yeah, I know I got the glossy black version and it's going to bore holes in my head with all the fingerprints. But yeah, it, it just looks so clean that I just had to get it. And it'll stay like that as long as you don't touch it. Anyways, with the earbuds out, we get a USB-C cable for charging, thankfully. You know, it just makes the whole process of packing your cables and charging your devices so much easier with just one port. It makes sense. And yes, it obviously should become the new standard. And I might be the millionth dude who says this, but Apple, please, maybe USB-C this year for the iPhones? Anywho, we also get a whole assortment of earbuds and wingtips. You can pick whichever you feel like. And lastly, there's a the documentation. All right then, now these are just first impressions, but this case is really small. It's almost at the level of AirPods, but just, you know, kind of vertical and maybe a little bit thicker. And without a doubt, this thing will be a breeze to carry around. And then for sound quality, we also have newer drivers here with separate ones for tweeters and subwoofer. That means that these earbuds are supposed to handle the highs and the lows with much better perfection. Now, of course, I'll talk all about it in the final review, but right now, I'm having high hopes for this one. Now, one small complaint I've had is that these do not support active noise cancellation. Now, of course, there is passive noise cancellation here. This one is a completely in-ear design, which means that there will be a good amount of noise reduction just with the seal that it creates in the ear. But in airplanes and other loud, noisy places, I'm pretty sure that anyone would prefer active noise cancellation. But it's actually got a transparency mode, which means that it'll use the mics to let in environmental noise. Now, this is helpful because maybe, let's say you want to go for a run and you're outside. You want to keep a check on your environment. You want to know what's going on outside. But you also want the tunes? Well, that's what transparency mode is for. It basically uses the mics to let in all the environmental noise and sounds. And speaking of microphones, the ones in these have been improved quite a bit. And of course, I'll give a final verdict in the full review. Then there's the Galaxy Wear app. It'll give some additional customizability options and also allow for super fast pairing. Then finally, we have the battery, which is hands down one of the biggest improvements that the Buzz Plus could have had. The previous versions were kind of lackluster in the battery life, but now the battery in the Buzz Plus is so, so much better. You can get a whopping 11 hours out of a single charge from the buds themselves. That's, I think, one of the, if not the highest battery life that I've seen on a wireless earbud. And additionally, you can get another 11 hours by charging it in the case. That's summing up to be a total of 22 hours. It puts it right up there with this competition like the AirPods. And it's basically a huge leap as compared to the original. You know, I think overall, the Buds Plus are definitely impressive and a much better product as compared to the original Buds Plus. Now, I'm hoping that it will live up to all the different promises, better sound quality, better mic quality. And the transparency mode is something I'm really interested in. I want to know how it pans out. Now, these do start at $150. And that in and of itself is quite competitive pricing. But maybe you can come across some deals or offers that can get you for... I don't know, $10 less. So I guess that's it for today. I'll be dropping the full review very soon. So do hit the subscribe button, drop a like if you enjoyed. And of course, do stay safe because I will be seeing you guys later. Cheers.